say that it, in the very near future, we will be able to provide better healthcare service with adequate space, equipment and staffing to not only Key Cocker, but our visitors as well. As you know, these projects come at a cost. I don't call it a cost, I call it investment. We are bound by oath to see that the lives of Belizeans are improved in one way or another. Of course, gratitude has to be given to our working partners and funding agencies like the Caribbean Development Bank and the CARICOM Development Fund. The confidence that these agencies has placed in SIF and the current administration is of great significance as it allows us to continue working for the greater good of Belize and its citizens. It is the accomplishment of a commitment made to the people of Kikaka. This health center is more than just a building. It means that for the first time, residents in this community will have access to proper health care in a proper facility. This government has fulfilled yet another promise in Plan Belize. The ever increasing threat of non communicable diseases such as diabetes, hypertension, heart disease, cancer, and mental health conditions requires a robust primary health care system to address these deadly conditions. This health facility will surely make a difference in the early diagnosis, treatment, and prevention of those conditions. Other services that will be provided include maternal and child health, outpatient consultations, emergency care, mental health, and services related to vector control and public health. An investment in health is an investment in our people, an investment for the future generations to come.